Arf! Arf! I mean, hey! Hey, what's up? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're going to be talking about the top 10 most dangerous dogs in the world. Dogs are a man's best friend, but it doesn't mean the same for everyone. Of course, these cute canine creatures are not just your regular dogs. When they bite you, you'll also bite the dust and probably kick the bucket. So, let's jump straight into the video and let's see who the best boys and girls in this list are. Number 10. Siberian Husky The fluffy and playful Siberian Husky is one of those dogs you'll really love to see in your Instagram or Twitter feed. The Siberian Husky is an intelligent and very loyal dog. Before, Siberian Huskies were used as sled dogs due to their thick, double-coated fur to help the Chukchi people in their daily lives, mostly in transport and hunting. Now, the Siberian Husky is a pretty popular dog breed. The reason you're most likely to avoid this dog is if you're threatening his or her master and you're something that looks like a pack of meat. Siberian Husky attacks accounted for a high number of incidents. The breed was responsible for 83 attacks over the test period. Of those attacks, 27 were maulings, which resulted in serious injuries, while 26 other husky attacks proved fatal. The Siberian husky boasts an average of 320 psi of bite force. Number 9. Bull Mastiff The Bull Mastiff is a crossover between an English Mastiff and an American Bulldog. While these dogs don't necessarily possess a threat as Mastiff, Mixing it with the American Bulldog makes it possible for these dogs to go crazy and maul you to death. Just like what happened to a small pincher who was bitten by a bull mastiff and was shaken like a doll. I'm sure you can draw the punchline now, but not just yet. The bull mastiff boasts a 406 psi of bite force, which is almost three times higher than that of a human's. Several laws were implemented to control the dog bite attacks, and so far, Mastiff variations are part of the said breed specific laws. Number 8. Doggo Argentino. The Doggo Argentino is a type of fighting and hunting dog, originating from Argentina. They're like the American pit bull, but they're more agile and muscular in body structure, which is needed to hunt other animals, such as the wild boar. Due to the nature of which these dogs work, the Doggo Argentino is under the Dangerous Dogs Act of 1991. It's a crime to own these types of dogs without the authorities' knowledge. You could carry a knife in the UK and you'll not get penalised. Get one of these dogs and you'll be sanctioned. The Doggo Argentino has a bite force of 500 psi. Oi, mate, you got a licence for that dog? Number 7. Presa Canario The Presa Canario is a type of guard or herd dog, which was mostly used in cattle farming. It originated from the Canary Island and was used before as a fighting dog in Spain until 1936. However, due to the dangerous nature of this dog, it was under the ban list of the customs of Australia and New Zealand. A Presa Canario in 2006 attacked an old lady, which suffered severe injuries before succumbing to her wounds. The Presa Canario has a bite force of 550 psi. Number 6. Cane Corso while the Cane Corso is less bulky compared to the Bull Mastiff, it still poses a danger that can pretty much kill more than just an animal. One of the most dangerous traits of the Cane Corso is its bite force of 700 psi, which is six times more than that of a human's, ranking only second to the Kangal, which has a 743 psi of bite force. Number 5. Wolf Dog Hybrid one of the best pets to own if you're trying to let your unwanted children experience being inside a body bag, the Wolf Dog Hybrid is an express way to all sorts of dog-related accidents. These unfortunate events could have been prevented if only you didn't try breeding a hybrid dog with a tendency to chow on your kids like a sheep in a wolf's clothing. There's a lot of myths surrounding this hybrid, as owners themselves are shilling that wolf dogs are better than your regular dogs. However, all of these myths have been debunked by a lot of studies. The wolf dog hybrid has a bite force of 406 psi, which is a lot higher than a regular breed. Number 4. Doberman Pinscher The Doberman Pinscher is a medium-sized dog, which is mostly seen in films and television as an aggressive dog. However, that's not really the case. 
The Doberman is considered the fifth most intelligent dog in a 1994 book called The Intelligence of Dogs. It's an excellent guard dog, but it can be challenging to rank it as a pet. The Doberman Pinscher has a bite force of 305 psi. Number 3. German Shepherd Intelligence, brave, and lovable. The German Shepherd is a well-known guard dog around the world. They're often seen inside airports, K9 units, together with security personnel. Disaster-related rescue operations, as well as bomb and drug-sniffing exercises and operations. The German Shepherd, though, a fierce and loyal service dog, their instincts as trained combatants can act just as nature intended, even if they don't enter the military. If you're ever planning to steal something from your neighbor and you see one of these good boys, you might as well forfeit winning a Darwin Award. With the bite force of 238 psi, you're going to be more than just a dog food. But feel free to try. Number 2. Rottweiler Rottweilers aren't really that scary, unless you piss them off. They're like the gym head version of the Doberman. Rottweilers were meant to be cart haulers, as well as homestead or farmhouse guard dogs. They're really intelligent dogs, however. They need a push as well as proper management and training exercises. I've never seen an aggressive Rottweiler, but most of the time they won't mind someone unless you're really their area. They're quite popular in the USA. However, they only account for 2% of the population of family-owned dogs. Their bite force is twice as strong as a human's. The human bite force is 126 to 150 psi. The Rottweilers is 328 to 350 psi. Number 1. American Pit Bull Terrier An utter bruh moment. American Pit Bull Terriers are just straight-up suicide, both for the owners and whoever is around this dog breed, within a radius of 30 meters. With a bite force of 235 psi, this dog doesn't sound dangerous, until you look at the statistics. A website called dogsbite.org had conducted research for 15 years, 2005 to 2019, and found out that a combined effort between the Pit Bull Terriers and Rottweilers resulted in the total death of 397 Americans. Despite making up only a combined 8% of the population of dogs in America, Pit Bulls and Rottweilers committed 50% of dog bite-related deaths during a 20-year period of government study from 1979 to 1998. These dogs are the OG in terms of harm caused against humans. Nicknamed as the Baby Killers by edgy Facebook users, American Pit Bull Terriers are considered the most dangerous dog breed in this list. Dogs are awesome, and they're loyal and one of the best pets to keep around. Just keep in mind the risks and provide the proper care they need. Anyway, if you like this video, be sure to leave a like and drop down in the comments below what you'd like us to cover next. Subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you all in the next one. Goodbye.